meditations and prayers relating to the law of God. Aleph. Blessed are those whose way is blameless, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who comply with his testimonies, and seek him with all their heart. They also do no injustice. They walk in his ways. You have ordained your precepts, that we are to keep them diligently. Oh that my ways may be established to keep your statutes. Then I will not be ashamed, when I look at all your commandments. I will give thanks to you with uprightness of heart, when I learn your righteous judgments. I will keep your statutes. Do not utterly abandon me. Beth. How can a young man keep his way pure? By keeping it according to your word. With all my heart I have sought you. Do not let me wander from your commandments. I have treasured your word in my heart, so that I may not sin against you. Blessed are you, Lord. Teach me your statutes. With my lips I have told of all the ordinances of your mouth. I have rejoiced in the way of your testimonies, as much as in all riches. I will meditate on your precepts and regard your ways. I shall delight in your statutes. I will not forget your word. Gimel. Deal generously with your servant, that I may live and keep your word. Open my eyes, that I may behold wonderful things from your law. I am a stranger on the earth. Do not hide your commandments from me. My soul is crushed with longing for your ordinances at all times. You rebuke the arrogant, the cursed, who wander from your commandments. Take disgrace and contempt away from me, for I comply with your testimonies. Even though rulers sit and speak against me, your servant meditates on your statutes. Your testimonies also are my delight. They are my advisers. Deleth. My soul clings to the dust. Revive me according to your word. I have told of my ways, and you have answered me. Teach me your statutes. Make me understand the way of your precepts, and I will meditate on your wonders. My soul weeps because of grief. Strengthen me according to your word. Remove the false way from me, and graciously grant me your law. I have chosen the faithful way. I have placed your judgments before me. I cling to your testimonies. Lord, do not put me to shame. I shall run the way of your commandments, for you will enlarge my heart. He. Teach me the way of your statutes, Lord, and I shall comply with it to the end. Give me understanding so that I may comply with your law and keep it with all my heart. Make me walk in the path of your commandments, for I delight in it. Incline my heart to your testimonies, and not to dishonest gain. Turn my eyes away from looking at what is worthless, and revive me in your ways. Establish your word to your servant as that which produces reverence for you. Take away my disgrace which I dread, for your judgments are good. Behold, I long for your precepts. Revive me through your righteousness. Vave. May your favor also come to me, Lord, your salvation according to your word. So that I will have an answer for one who taunts me, for I trust in your word. And do not take the word of truth utterly out of my mouth, for I wait for your judgments. So I will keep your law continually, forever and ever. And I will walk at liberty, for I seek your precepts. I will also speak of your testimonies before kings and shall not be ashamed. I will delight in your commandments, which I love and I shall lift up my hands to your commandments, which I love, and I will meditate on your statutes. Zayn. Remember the word to your servant, in which you have made me hope. This is my comfort in my misery, that your word has revived me. The arrogant utterly deride me, yet I do not turn aside from your law. I have remembered your judgments from of old, Lord, and comfort myself. Burning indignation has seized me because of the wicked, who abandon your law. Your statutes are my songs in the house of my pilgrimage. Lord, I remember your name in the night, and keep your law. This has become mine, that I comply with your precepts. Hath. The Lord is my portion. I have promised to keep your words. I sought your favor with all my heart. Be gracious to me according to your word. I considered my ways, and turned my feet to your testimonies. I hurried and did not delay to keep your commandments. The snares of the wicked have surrounded me but I have not forgotten your law. At midnight I will rise to give thanks to you because of your righteous judgments. I am a companion to all those who fear you, and to those who keep your precepts. The earth is full of your goodness, Lord. Teach me your statutes. Teth. You have treated your servant well, Lord, according to your word. Teach me good discernment and knowledge, for I believe in your commandments. Before I was afflicted I went astray, but now I keep your word. You are good and you do good. Teach me your statutes. The arrogant have forged a lie against me. With all my heart I will comply with your precepts. 
the heart is insensitive, like fat, but I delight in your law. It is good for me that I was afflicted, so that I may learn your statutes. The law of your mouth is better to me than thousands of gold and silver pieces. Yod. Your hands made me and fashioned me. Give me understanding, so that I may learn your commandments. May those who fear you see me and be glad, because I wait for your word. I know, Lord, that your judgments are righteous, and that you have afflicted me in faithfulness. May your favor comfort me, according to your word to your servant. May your compassion come to me so that I may live, for your law is my delight. May the arrogant be put to shame, because they lead me astray with a lie. But I shall meditate on your precepts. May those who fear you turn to me, and those who know your testimonies. May my heart be blameless in your statutes, so that I will not be ashamed. Cough. My soul anguishes for your salvation. I wait for your word. My eyes fail with longing for your word, while I say, When will you comfort me? Though I have become like a wineskin in the smoke, I do not forget your statutes. How many are the days of your servant? When will you execute judgment on those who persecute me? The arrogant have dug pits for me, people who are not in accord with your law. All your commandments are faithful. They have persecuted me with a lie. Help me. They almost destroyed me on earth, but as for me, I did not abandon your precepts. Revive me according to your faithfulness, so that I may keep the testimony of your mouth. Lamed. Forever, Lord, your word stands in heaven. Your faithfulness continues throughout generations. You established the earth, and it stands. They stand this day by your ordinances, for all things are your servants. If your law had not been my delight, then I would have perished in my misery. I will never forget your precepts, for by them you have revived me. I am yours, save me. For I have sought your precepts. The wicked wait for me to destroy me. I will diligently consider your testimonies. I have seen a limit to all perfection. Your commandment is exceedingly broad. Mum. How I love your law. It is my meditation all the day. Your commandments make me wiser than my enemies, for they are ever mine. I have more insight than all my teachers, for your testimonies are my meditation. I understand more than those who are old, because I have complied with your precepts. I have restrained my feet from every evil way, so that I may keep your word. I have not turned aside from your judgments, for you yourself have taught me. How sweet are your words to my taste. Yes, sweeter than honey to my mouth. From your precepts I get understanding. Therefore I hate every false way. None. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. I have sworn and I will confirm it, that I will keep your righteous judgments. I am exceedingly afflicted. Revive me, Lord, according to your word. Be pleased to accept the voluntary offerings of my mouth, Lord, and teach me your judgments. My life is continually in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, yet I have not wandered from your precepts. I have inherited your testimonies forever, for they are the joy of my heart. I have inclined my heart to perform your statutes forever, even to the end. Same. I hate those who are double-minded, but I love your law. You are my hiding place and my shield. I wait for your word. Leave me, you evildoers so that I may comply with the commandments of my God. Sustain me according to your word, that I may live. And do not let me be ashamed of my hope. Sustain me so that I may be safe, that I may have regard for your statutes continually. You have rejected all those who stray from your statutes, for their deceitfulness is useless. You have removed all the wicked of the earth like impurities. Therefore I love your testimonies. My flesh trembles from the fear of you, and I am afraid of your judgments. Amen. I have done justice and righteousness. Do not leave me to my oppressors. Be a guarantor for your servant for good. Do not let the arrogant depress me. My eyes fail with longing for your salvation, and for your righteous word. Deal with your servant according to your graciousness, and teach me your statutes. I am your servant. Give me understanding, so that I may know your testimonies. It is time for the Lord to act, for they have broken your law. Therefore I love your commandments above gold, yes above pure gold. Therefore I carefully follow all your precepts concerning everything, I hate every false way. P. Your testimonies are wonderful. Therefore my soul complies with them. The unfolding of your words gives light. It gives understanding to the simple. I opened my mouth wide and panted, for I longed for your commandments. Turn to me and be gracious to me, as is right for those who love your name.
Establish my footsteps in your word, and do not let any wrongdoing have power over me. Redeem me from oppression by man, so that I may keep your precepts. Make your face shine upon your servant, and teach me your statutes. My eyes shed streams of water, because they do not keep your law. Zad. You are righteous, Lord, and your judgments are right. You have commanded your testimonies in righteousness and great faithfulness. My zeal has consumed me, because my enemies have forgotten your words. Your word is very pure, therefore your servant loves it. I am small and despised, yet I do not forget your precepts. Your righteousness is in everlasting righteousness, and your law is truth. Trouble and anguish have come upon me, yet your commandments are my delight. Your testimonies are righteous forever. Give me understanding that I may live. If I cried out with all my heart. Answer me, Lord. I will comply with your statutes. I cried to you. Save me and I shall keep your testimonies. I rise before dawn and cry for help. I wait for your words. My eyes anticipate the night watches, so that I may meditate on your word. Hear my voice according to your faithfulness. Revive me, Lord, according to your judgments. Those who follow after wickedness approach. They are far from your law. You are near, Lord, and all your commandments are truth. From long ago I have known from your testimonies that you have founded them forever. Rish. Look at my affliction and rescue me, for I have not forgotten your law. Plead my cause and redeem me. Revive me according to your word. Salvation is far from the wicked, for they do not seek your statutes. Great are your mercies, Lord. Revive me according to your judgments. Many are my persecutors and my enemies, yet I do not turn aside from your testimonies. I see the treacherous and loathe them, because they do not keep your word. Consider how I love your precepts. Revive me, Lord, according to your faithfulness. The sum of your word is truth, and every one of your righteous judgments is everlasting. Shin. Rulers persecute me without cause, but my heart stands in awe of your words. I rejoice at your word, like one who finds great plunder. I hate and loathe falsehood, but I love your law. Seven times a day I praise you because of your righteous judgments. Those who love your law have great peace, and nothing causes them to stumble. I hope for your salvation, Lord, and to your commandments. My soul keeps your testimonies, and I love them exceedingly. I keep your precepts and your testimonies, for all my ways are before you. Div. Let my cry come before you, Lord. Give me understanding according to your word. Let my pleading come before you. Save me according to your word. Let my lips pour out praise, for you teach me your statutes. Let my tongue sing about your word, for all your commandments are righteousness. Let your hand be ready to help me, for I have chosen your precepts. I long for your salvation, Lord, and your law is my delight. Let my soul live that it may praise you, and let your ordinances help me. I have wandered about like a lost sheep. Search for your servant, for I do not forget your commandments.